Good morning, people. Um, so just as I post a video saying that uh, this fight was going to happen, the reason it took me so long was because I was confident that it wasn't going to happen. Now, then I started thinking, yeah, Al's going to cash in on Adrian Broner with the problems, the problem that he is. Uh, I don't know if he's about brain damage or since he's the can man, if he's about eating out a can. Because that's where he's fucking heady, all right? I've been in similar trouble. And let me tell you something. Them lawyers are not fucking cheap. Alright. Now, I also peeped that some of his jewelry is fucking fake. He's a fraud, alright? So then I started thinking, you know how he calls out everybody, you know, he wants to fight Matisse, he wants to do this, that, and the third. Uh a lot of times when he's calling these fighters out, they already got fights, they got their own shit going on. Um, Adrian Broner is a fucking clown. And it's a shame because he's got a lot of natural talent. And, you know, the thought popped in my head. Uh, is it the fact that, you know, the, the payday that he got guaranteed it'll be the best payday he'll ever get in his fucking life? You can add up the next 15 fights he'll take. And it won't add up to what he was offered. So, as a fan, I got to think, uh, did he want to turn down the money? Or did he not want to get his face destroyed by Manny Pacquiao? And I'm starting to think it might not have been the money. It might have been uh, flashbacks of Marcos Madonna and then thinking of the the speed and the crazy angles that Pacquiao can deliver to his flat-footed, you know, uh, his flat-footed style. So, yeah, apparently the fight's off. I can see it now. Broner's gonna blame it on Bob Arum. But believe me, uh, Al Heyman could have reached into that war chest and pulled out a shitload of money. But he knows it's time to cash in on this motherfucker now. Because, uh, well, like I said before, he might cash in on out on uh, Adrian Broner's insurance policy. But, you know, I, I was kind of excited to see the fight. But, you know, this is boxing. Shit happens. And this is JR coming to you from Baltimore. Peace out.